Remove the deck. Leave the strapping tape on the sides of the boat. Turn the deck over and fill the underside of the deck seams with epoxy. Next, mix a small amount of epoxy with wood flour until it is a consistency drier than peanut butter. Spread a fillet of this very thick epoxy in the gap between the deck reinforcement plates at the front of the cockpit. Also, fill at the edges of the reinforcement plates to create a ramp where the fiberglass tape will be laid. Fill it along the edge of the pre-cut butt plate behind the cockpit, too. Cut six three and a half inch pieces of tape. Using three of the six short pieces of tape you've cut, lay a piece of tape over each of the seams where the reinforcement plates meet. Mix up some epoxy and wet this tape out and lay the other three, three and a half inch pieces on top of the first. You now have two layers of tape over the reinforcement plate seams. Next, paint an inch and a half to two inch width of epoxy on each deck seam. Now, lay one layer of glass tape down the entire length of all of the inside deck seams. Wet this tape out with epoxy. This will give you a total of three layers of tape over each of the fillets. Let the epoxy get tacky, usually about two hours, and set the deck back on the boat and align the tape and deck back in place. Remember to put some plastic film at the ends and over the frames. 